Hey guys, another quick update. So I've been trying to think about how I'm actually going to mount this exoskeleton to my body, and I've been having a bit of trouble. So I thought, maybe I should use something that's already been pre-designed. You know what that is? Camping backpacks. And I'm not actually going to use this, but I'm going to design it based off of it. So let's take a look. You got your two shoulder straps, and then there's also the main belt. Now I'd have to beef this up a little bit because this frame is going to be able to pick up a few hundred pounds, so I'd better make sure that it can support a couple hundred pounds on my back. So the reason I don't really want to use this for the actual exoskeleton is it's made of aluminum so I can't weld to it and there's no easy way for me to attach to the the square tubing so I think I'm going to recreate this frame out of steel square tubing welded together the fun part will be making this curve but I think I can do that by notching the steel tube using the grinder to cut two angles bending it and then welding the seam shut. So it'll be an interesting piece of work to do, but I think I'll have a really strong frame then. So here's some of the three-quarter inch steel tubing I'm thinking I might use to rebuild this frame. I only have a few feet right now, so I'm gonna have to go out and buy some more. So basically I'm thinking I'll have a fixed joint at the shoulder, which will take all the load, and I'll be using one of the spherical rod ends. But then what I'm hoping to do is add some cylinders off of the back and the chest, connecting to above and below this, to also add strength in uh, lifting the arm sideways. But it's going to be tricky, because basically the more cylinders I add, I'm going to be removing basically degrees of freedom from the suit. So, as it is right now, just having the ability to lift and push down, that will be the most flexible. But as soon as I start adding more cylinders to the front and back, it's going to start restricting my movement, making it harder to have a flexible, lightweight suit. So I think I'll start with this, and then see what I can add onto it without, without um, reducing my mobility. Also, I, I really can't draw.